you do mention this a lot uh, where you talk about um, women should find a man, a good man, not just any man. Um, but, you know, one of the things that comes with having one is is the security and protection that you always mention, right? Right. So something just happened recently um, where it's a pretty famous model. Her name's uh, Abigail Ratchford. Um, she got plenty of money. She got a nice big house. Yeah. It got broken into by three men just recently uh, while she's there. Um, I guess she was upstairs watching a movie, and these three men are just... Let's just watch the video. Let's take a see, take a look at the video real quick. It's like the, her surveillance footage. It's only like a few seconds long. Let's take a look and see what happened. Yeah. Yeah. So as you can see, these three guys are just doing whatever they want in the house. Like, yeah. Like they live there. Where's your cat? Where's your dog? Right. I'm just seeing, she might not even have a dog. Or oh. It's so big that the dog didn't even hear it. Yeah. Maybe the house is too big. Maybe maybe, uh, maybe her bunny heard it or her turtle. Oh, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. They got in. It doesn't even look like they have to break anything to get in. And they're just walking around with a crowbar. They just it, kick it, the door open. It kills me when you see like... A woman in a position of power, right? She's achieved what a lot of women have not achieved. And a lot of women want this. They want to be this independent because they want to have their own house. They want to have their own apartment. They want to have their own condo. They want to have their own car. And you're beautiful. You made it, right? But you don't have no protection, right? You replace the man with a dog or you replace the man with a cat or you replace a man with a snake, right? Or you replace a man with a woman, <laughs> right? Yeah. That's that's either that's what's happening. Women are replacing men with with pets or women, and 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 women don't work well with women. They have the highest domestic violence in America, right? They kill each other, so uh, it doesn't work. But they still tend to date women, right? But or or they got pets, right? Three men break in your house, your dog ain't gonna do shit. Three men break in your house, your cat ain't going to do shit. Especially that, not if they have a weapon, too. Especially a snake, right? I I, I was just talking stupid. to Ramin, like, when before the show started, and I was just talking about, damn, how many women are in the street right now? How many shelter that women are in America right now? And I was like, why do you think there's so many women in America right now in shelters with no protection? They in the street. Some of these women used to be prominent women. They used to be beautiful women. They used to be women with with no high body count. Or they 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 was women that was respected at one point. Why why are they in the streets with no protection? I mean, what 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 is the reason? And I I, I try to tell them, I don't know. What do you say, Remy? Was it? I think, I mean, I think it, it has to do with just the the way our society is built now. Um things are constantly evolving and changing uh, within the human race, but I think when you have a, a lot of women that you have a lot of men, first of all, that are bums that right. aren't in a position to help or take care of a woman in the first place, they can't even take care of themselves. So that's an issue. I agree but with then that. With the men that there is um, that do have that capability, I, I'm assuming that most women don't wouldn't want to submit to that man or 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 follow their lead, and the man's not interested in dealing with them, and so then they stay alone for that reason too. So you got an option to either submit to the man that actually could take care of you, or you got an option of a man that can't even take care of himself. So right. you lose, it's a lose-lose. Right. Who needs to change? Well, listen. By the way, real quick correction. Uh, they did break in. There's a picture of the glass they broke all over the place from the swimming pool. Um, and that's how they got in. Yeah. But yeah, go ahead. I guess what I was going to say is this. Even if you achieve a status where you have money and you finally get what you want, you still have no protection. So was it worth it? Yeah, I mean, you, they broke glass. You had to have heard that. You're sitting upstairs watching she, she, the movie. What if they just walked into her she, bedroom? She's terrified. Three men. She's terrified. In the bedroom. Can you her. imagine what... Listen, this is why I say... And she's a model. Listen, this is why I say to women, it's no shot to you. But listen, when World War III happens and we go back to the strain age, you guys are fucked. And not only you fucked, but gay men. You more fucked than the women. You think in the real world that it's going to be accepted. They're going to crucify all you after World War III. And this is why I try to explain to some women 
If you can find your young king right now, commit to him, build with him, so you can have legacies to protect you and your kingdom. This is why it's so important to find a husband. Y'all want to be out here? Fucking 15 men? 25 men? 35 men? And you want to keep being wild, but you have no protection? They're killing you. You're dying at a high rate. And America's not protecting our women. They're failing. They can't even protect the homeless. They're murdering <laughs> everybody. It's no longer safe in America. Our politicians <laughs> have completely failed us. Our government has failed us. They care more about their pockets and their wealth than helping citizens. You stupid. This is the reality we live in. And you women follow these, these leaders. That's leaving you to hell. It's hell. And it's hot. So, when you look at her, I don't care if you're an actress. I don't care if you're an A-list actress or a D-list. I don't care if you're a model or A-list model or a D-list. I don't care. I don't care what you are. If you're a female and you're attractive, why are you failing to secure a husband or a man to give you some type of protection? Or pay out of your pocket like we have as men have to. If we have some type of status, you have to pay almost 100000 to a half a million dollars a year in security protection. Some pay a million to three million a year to protect their families. So women are going to have to keep paying it out of the bag. It's just the way it is. If you don't want to get protection, you're going to have to do what Oprah's doing. A lot of these women right now who are big in Hollywood, but they have no husbands. They have no career, really. They're, they're scrapping up every time just to get an opportunity to, 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 to win. Women ain't getting paid fairly, right? They, they complain about it every day. I'm not, I'm not getting paid what an A-list actor is getting paid, right? Especially black entertainment, right? So I, I, I would say this. I got a minute on this left. If you're a model actress or whatever you are and you're a woman you must do everything to secure a man so you can guarantee your protection what's better than a man managing you go look at the most successful models or entertainers or anybody as a woman it is because a man manages it y'all i don't understand why y'all don't under, like understand how good a man is for a woman that's why jay-z and beyonce work and, they, and they're not going to stop working unless they let the inside, I mean, or the outside noise get into their relationship. But they're not doing that. They're so protected where they're so getting richer and richer and richer. Why y'all, this gremlins in the Matrix, letting society destroy you. You're not winning. Y'all not happy. Most people are miserable, right? I mean, and, yeah. and I, I, I don't know. I, I hope that she has insurance. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure she does. She got a lot of money. I mean, she's she probably gets paid very well. She's been doing it for a while. But the problem is, like I said, you got three criminals that are all men coming in with a weapon, breaking your house, and you're a model. Yeah, it could have been bad. You're there by yourself. She in the lucky. Bedroom. It could have been bad. It yeah. could have been brutal. Very lucky. She's she's beyond lucky. Think about three man weapon. What they could have did to her, or how long they could have did it to her, and how long before somebody would have found out. It could have been days. Some of these yeah. people, celebrities don't go out like that. They don't. Sometimes they don't work for like two weeks, so they chilling in their cribs, comfortable. That's why they have all this shit in their house. Look how nice her crib was. She's not leaving. So can you imagine somebody breaking her house and for three days they had uh, access to this woman? What could have happened? This is the problem why I say men must protect women and we need to wake up in America. We need to, if, if you women want to keep pushing men away, you're going to end up in the streets. And, and, and the wars are happening in America. It's not stopping. War is not stopping. It's going to get to a point where it's going to get worse. And who you think first is going to be destroyed. It's going to be society and how women think. And it's going to be the people who, 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 who kind of wave their hands gotcha. and, and do some, some, some weird shit, right? All that shit out the window when World War III happens. Everybody lose protection. And women are going to go back to a point where they have to look out and be protected by men and they're going to have to get back in the houses. They're going to have to get back in cooking. Society's ripping apart, man. Y'all, I'm telling you, y'all better find your husband.
Thank you for watching the Cash Money Dreams podcast. Like and subscribe. Follow us on every platform. Stay tuned. Every week we drop in a new episode. It's your boy Cash, man.